Hello guys, welcome back to another video and in today's video I'm going to show you how to get to this secret maze within Elden Ring. The video is going to consist of two parts. The first part is actually finding the location of this hidden maze and the second part is I'm going to guide you through the maze itself. So if you already found this maze, you can skip to the second part and now let's begin. But before we get started, I am almost at a thousand subscribers and it is my dream to become a professional YouTuber. So if you can help me out, please subscribe to the channel. I'm giving away a hundred dollar Amazon gift card as soon as I reach it and we're almost there. So again, I would be really grateful if you could help me out. And now really, uh, let's really begin this video. Okay, so let's, uh, let's begin. So we're going to start at the underground roadside side of Grace and we're going to make our way up to the Cathedral of the Forsaken. This is the beginning of the maze. So again, if you already found it, you can skip to part two. Um, and as soon as we get there and we go down the maze, then the last side of Grace will be at the bottom and this will be the frenzied flame uh, proscription side of Grace. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to start following this route um, uh, I, I sped the uh, I speed up I sped up the um, the video a bit. Uh, first thing we're going to do is we're going to open the door that you just saw um, by going uh, to follow this route. Now, if you go down, you need to make a right turn. Watch out for the reds. Make another right turn and uh, jump over these holes. There will be two holes. This was the first one, and we will get the second one here. If you fall down, you need to get back up and it takes a little bit uh, more time. Now we're going to continue and make our way down. Um, you can fight this guy. Actually wouldn't do it. You might just want to run up. There will be another one. Uh, so we're going to skip this part a bit. So that's it. Let's continue our way. Climb up the ladder. And open this door. This is not the door that you just saw because we need to continue this road. What we do want to do is we want to open the gate in case we get, uh, in case we die. And we all know that's uh, likely within the game. Okay, now instead of just going to the right, we're going to the left um, and we're going to fall down. And be precise because otherwise you will die. And uh, now we're going to continue this road. Defeat this guy or not, I'll leave it up to you. Grab the string. I'm going to follow this road. Just continue the road. Now, you can go two ways. If you... We need to go over here. But if we continue downwards over there, then we're not getting to the place we want to go. So we're not getting over here. But we're going... Um, we're going over here. So continue over here. Follow the route. Watch out for these frogs that we're going to encounter. They're quite nasty. I would suggest you just keep on running. Now, you can go two ways here. You can defeat the guy. You can go up the ladder. I would suggest you just go up the ladder. So I'm going to skip this part as well. So that's it. Climb up the ladder. And what you will do then is you will actually open the door, which I just told you in the beginning of the video that we want to open. In case we die in the game, we can... Uh, quickly go back now as soon as we've done that i'm going to uh, revive if you can say it like that i'm going to sit at the side of grace because i want to get everything back as it was and we're going to follow this route and what we're actually going to do because you already saw those pipes before what we're going to do is we're going to actually jump into one of these pipes which will bring us down into the sewers even lower because the maze is at the lowest point of the sewers. Okay, so following this route, we want to go up here, then fall down and go through the door on the left, what we just saw. So let's do that. Let's see if there aren't any enemies left. I don't think so. So we're going to jump down over here. And we're going to follow this route. Watch out for this guy. So let's continue. We're going to jump into this hole and we're going to follow the road. So walk with me here. We're going to make a left. We're going to go down again and we're going to jump into this hole. Now there will be a guy stabbing you. And once you defeat it, go the other way. So now we're just going to run down. We're going to encounter a stairs. And once we're down, there will be an elevator. 
Okay, so once you get here, you need to take the elevator and uh, the elevator will take you to the lowest point of the sewers. Now, I would suggest touching the side of Grace because we need to fight Mog the Omen. Um, and once we've done that, we can continue our way to the maze. So once we encounter this enemy, I will skip forward and uh, so we can continue. So uh, hit the wall behind the chest and a secret passage will open. So you need to do that. So I want to congratulate you because you've made it to the maze itself. Now I'm going to show you how to get down through the maze. It's quite difficult, but if you follow my lead and use this trick, you will get down easily. So we're going to jump down over here. And then the second one, this is still easy. Now you see this guy sitting there, right? On the right. Now we're going to jump over here and stay at this side of this wall. Now jump down over here. Take your time doing so. And then the next one will be over here. And the last one you need to roll down just to be safe. And then there will be these ashes of war. They are really great, so pick it up. And that was the hardest part. So now we're going to make our way uh, in here. And on the left, we can see a uh, stairs, which we're going to follow. And um, after that, when we, once we get down, it's actually quite easy. You just don't jump down, you won't die. And that's the, uh, that's the maze itself and the way down. I'm not going to spoil anything uh, what's down there. There will be a secret door though. I'm not going to tell you how to get through. If you really want to know, just search on Google. Uh, make sure to rethink if you want to go through the door because it will actually give you an alternative ending. So if you don't want to do that, just um, don't go in. And that's it. I really want to thank you for watching this video. Please give it a like, consider subscribing, and I hope to see you again soon. Bye.